Could this be a major solution amid years of rising homicides? The Multnomah County District Attorney's Office is restructuring, announcing a homicide unit today. So this means a group of prosecutors will be dedicated solely to homicide cases. The DA says to help them work more efficiently with law enforcement. Now, Brandon Thompson pressing the DA on this major move. And Brandon, I know you're finding out why now is the time for this move. Well, homicides have quadrupled in 2022 from 2016, and prosecutors say that blew out their old model with handling these complex cases. So they're hoping that this new homicide unit can make the process more efficient. Facing a record number of homicide cases, the Multnomah County District Attorney's Office is creating a unit to deal with those cases specifically. It centralizes those uh, prosecutions with an experienced team who uh, can make sure that those cases are handled appropriately. Last year, PPB data shows 101 homicides in Portland, 81 more than eight years ago. For years, deputy district attorneys would rotate going to a homicide when called and following the case to the end. That model became unworkable for uh, many of the DAs who were asked to uh, respond and handle these cases. The homicide unit will have six deputy district attorneys, two investigators, and two support staff solely focused on the homicide cases in the office. The DA's office estimates the prosecutors will have about 20 cases each. Do you think that attorney could handle that many homicide cases with how complex they are? Would it be better if there were 10 or 15 deputy district attorneys in the homicide unit? Sure. Uh, but that would effectively cut so deeply into the other uh, major felony trial units that they wouldn't be able to perform their core functions. Jackson hopes it means the district attorneys will be able to work with police investigators and attend trainings on homicide cases they could not do before. That will increase the consistency and also really create a team uh, type of environment with uh, the homicide investigators. District Attorney Mike Schmidt says his office will form a homicide review committee with OHSU, sending researchers completed cases to study and find ways to intervene in the future. Our hope is to look at multiple systems of the victims, of the person who is the shooter, uh, and see if there are any patterns that emerge to us. So Schmidt's office has also created the Auto Task Force and the Retail Theft Task Force. I asked if this homicide unit was born out of anything missed in homicide cases leading up to this point. Jackson said no, but he does hope that this group of prosecutors can help solve some of the cold cases the DA's office has. Reporting live in downtown Portland, Brandon Thompson, Point Six News. All right, Brandon, thank you. A